Hey everyone, here's a question from exercise 1.4, 6 question, chapter is integer of class 7. The question is, in a class test, 3 marks, that is plus 3 marks are given for every correct answer and minus 2 marks are given for every incorrect answer and no marks for not attempting any question. We have two questions here. The first one is, Radhika scored 20 marks and if she has got 12 correct answer, how many questions has she attempted incorrectly? So let's solve the first question and I'm going to read the second question later. Radhika has scored 20 marks, that is both like correct and incorrect after adding both the marks, she got 20 marks. And we have also given that she has attempted 12 correct answers and we have to find out how many incorrect answers she has attempted. So let's write down the answer here. This is first question. Now what we know from, from this first question, so we know that she has given uh, 12 correct uh, 12 correct answers right so for 12 means how many marks she has got so for 12 correct answers the uh, like they are giving up 3 marks for every correct answer right so it will be 12 into 3 which will be equal to 36 marks so total for correct answer she got 36 marks but the total score is 20 which means she has attempted wrong answers also but how many she has attempted so what we're going to do we're going to find the difference between the total like the correct answers one and the how much total she got so if we, if we come to know how much total incorrect answer score is then we can able to find out number of incorrect answers so total score for incorrect answer okay we're finding out how much what was the score for the incorrect answer so total score for incorrect answers will be we have to just subtract the both the marks so 36 so total marks are 20 right so total from total we have to subtract don't subtract 36 and 20 because again you're going to end up with positive answer but since we're finding out for the incorrect answer the answer has to be negative because they, they are giving a neg minus two marks so it will be 20 minus 36 which will be equal to minus 16 so minus 16 marks she got for incorrect answer now we have to find out the number of incorrect answers so therefore number of incorrect answers will be now for every incorrect answer they are giving minus 2 marks so we have to find out how many minus 2 are present in this minus 16 so to find out that we have to just divide so divide this minus 16 by minus 2 why dividing with minus 2 because for every incorrect answer they are uh, giving minus 2 marks so we have to find out in this minus 16 how many minus 2's are there so minus and minus will get cancelled cancel this in two table two ones are and then two eights are so total eight eight questions so she has g like attempted eight incorrect questions that is the first question second question is similar to that so let me erase this now the second one what they are given mohini scores minus five marks in this test like the total score is minus five though she has got seven correct answers how many questions has she attempted incorrectly similar to the first question total score is minus five which means she has attempted more incorrect answers because total score is becoming minus five right and they have given that though she has correct she has attempted seven correct answer so let's find out how it's similar to the first question so first we'll write down the mohini score so total marks will be minus 5 right and we're going to find out the total answer total score for the correct answer so total score or total marks total marks for correct answer now for every correct answer they are giving three marks right so total how many correct answers she has given she got total seven correct answer so seven multiplied by three which will be 21 so total she has got 21 marks correct answer now the same thing so total incorrect answers total score or total marks for the incorrect answer will be it's like a first question so marks scored for incorrect answer 
so from total marks we're going to subtract the marks obtained like in the correct answers so total she got is minus 5 from this we're going to subtract the 21 okay so this will be equal to minus 26 so total incorrect answers she got here is minus 21 marks for incorrect answers and using this we're going to find out the number of incorrect question so therefore number of incorrect questions will be so minus 26 divided by minus 2 same like a first question minus and minus will get cancelled 2 and 26 when you cancel you'll get 13 so 13 incorrect questions she has attempted I hope it is clear let me explain the second question once again they have given that total marks she has got final marks are minus 5 Mohini scored minus 5 marks but she has attempted correct answers and incorrect answers so remember that total marks are minus which means she has attempted more incorrect answers now before that we're gonna find out how many correct answers how much marks she got for correct answer in the question they have given seven correct answers she has attempted so seven into three will be 21 marks so uh, she got 21 marks, but due to the negative answering that due to the negative like incorrect answer She she lost her marks. So but how many we're gonna subtract this 21 and 5 like for minus 5 I'm gonna subtract minus 20 like 21 because why we are subtracting 21 from 5 because 5 is a minus 5 is a total score so minus 5 and then minus 21 which is equal to minus 26 so total she has got minus 26 in for the incorrect answers but how many questions she has attempted we have to again divide with minus 2 why minus 2 because for every incorrect answer they are giving minus 2 marks so we have to find out here in this minus 26 how many minus 2 are present so divide with it and you'll get the answer i hope this question is clear though it's very lengthy in case you have for the question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching